Look into the statement, beta. You need to tell whether the statement is true, false, or uncertain. The statement is saying, in population regression function, yi is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 xi plus ui. The slope coefficient beta 2 measures slope of y per unit change in xi. Now, you need to understand that when I go ahead and we write the population regression function, yi is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 xi plus ui. You know, in the first analysis, you may say that this statement is true. Because when I will find dy by d, d dy by d xi, it will give me the answer as beta 2, right? So you may say that, yes, ma'am, this is correct. This is the slope coefficient and it is equal to the change in y due to the change in x's, right? But in fact, this is an incorrect statement. The answer is that, you know, we don't say beta 2 is uh, the amount by which y changes when x changes. Rather, we go ahead and we say that this beta 2 is the amount by which y changes on an average, on an average when x changes. So we use this term called on an average and this tells us how y changes in its mean value, in its average value in exchanges. So ideally speaking, if you remember, then this part actually represented e of y given xi, right? This part represented e of y given xi. And a population regression function could have been written as e of y given xi plus ui, right? Where e of y given xi can be written as beta 1 plus beta 2 xi. So now if I just differentiate e of y given xi with respect to xi, differentiation of constant will be 0 plus beta 2 into 1. So this will be beta 2. So actually speaking, when I talk about this beta 2, beta 2 actually goes ahead and tells me how the average value of y changes as x changes. And if I were to go ahead and I were to also use this mathematical, you know, interpretation wise. So if you remember my example, that consumption is equal to 40 plus 0 0.9 times the income. So we can go ahead and say that when income increases by one unit, then on an average, consumption increases by 0 0.9 units. On an average, consumption increases by 0 0.9 units. So we use the term on an average. That's the important term here. Am I clear with it? So again, beta, this statement would be a false statement. It would be an incorrect statement.